Interactius is a Jupyter notebook to inform invasive species risk assessment. Imagine if pet shops in your country were importing spiders and you wanted to know what the potential risks of, of this are. What might happen if these were either released or escaped into the natural environment? Well, you might do this through expert risk assessment. You might commission experts to go away, study the literature and use their expertise to understand the potential risks on native biodiversity. You might be able to give them models based on climatic conditions of where that species might occur in your country. But invasive species impacts are much more about how one in organism impacts with another. And organisms impact each other in many different ways. They eat each other. They help each other. They cause disease. They carry disease. They live on one another. In fact, every ecosystem is a complex web of different interactions between organisms, and it's very difficult to model or understand how an introduction of any one new species might impact other species within that ecosystem. This is where Interactives is meant to help. Interactives takes primary interacting species for any target taxon and finds them from the Global Biotic Interactions database. It then takes all of those species and finds any species it interacts with them. It then looks up all of those on the GBIF taxonomic backbone and gets area of occupancy from the occurrence cube created from GBIF occurrences. It then removes any interactions that can't occur in the country because one or both of the organisms don't occur there, and it visualizes that. This is then given to experts who can then evaluate how uh, those interactions might impact native biodiversity, and it can trigger further research. And this is all used to support policy decisions in the end. So here is Interactius. This is an example of Reeve Monk Jack in Belgium. In this network, all of the blue nodes are animals, all the green nodes are plants. The nodes are all scaled by the area of occupancy of that particular species in Belgium. The target species, which in this case is Reeve Monk Jack, is in the center in red, and as you can see, it interacts with Cardamine pretensi. Cardamine pretensi is also eaten by three butterflies here. And one could imagine that an increase in the population of Reed's monk jack might have an impact on cardamine pretensi populations, and that might then have a consequent impact on the butterfly species as well. If you don't know the, uh, the name in Latin of any particular species, you can click on it and it'll take you to the species page on GBIF to uh, so you can find out more information about the global distribution, including pictures and common names. If you don't know how something interacts with each with anything, you can click on the edge and it'll take you to Globy and you can look more about the edge and get some references to uh, that particular evidence. You can move any of these around so you can make it more visible. And there's some more information on the left where you can look at all of the different interactions on Globy for those particular species or that particular species. Well, I hope you enjoy playing with uh, Interactius. All of the instructions for running it and the source code are on GitHub at this link here. I just need to acknowledge uh, Jorik Polan for his help uh, from Globy the Center for Invasion Biology, where I did a sabbatical last year, Miser Botanic Garden, where I work, and the Trias Project and the Belgian Science Policy Office, who funded. Thank you very much for your attention.